Transit riders and environmentalists made their way to City Hall today to try and convince City Council to introduce a new levy on commercial parking lots. They say it's in an effort to try and increase the revenue for the struggling TTC to the tune of what they say is hundreds of millions of dollars. We know that there are many revenue tools that we can that's available to us. And it's important to explore all those revenue tools. And uh, one of the things that we are looking at is commercial um, parking levies. Taxing those providing parking for cars at big malls and commercial lots to make money for transit. It's an idea that's been raised before in Toronto and parked, as it were, before surfacing again thanks to a massive hole in the city's budget today. A commercial parking levy, in short, could be a really huge source of uh, funding for a city that's struggling to keep up its transit system, uh, a city that's struggling to fund its own climate plan, uh, a city that's struggling to, to simply pay the bills. A report produced by consultants KPMG in 2016 suggested that a parking levy applied to paid spaces had the potential to generate revenues of $35 million to $535 million annually, depending on on how they're implemented. The groups presenting at City Hall this morning say that close to $3 billion could have been raised over the last five years. Mayor John Tory has said the number is exaggerated. This is the position you find yourself in when you're the mayor, is that, and I guess I conduct myself in the mayor, as mayor, I hope in a way that acts responsibly and doesn't just say, sure, let's have a parking levy and it's gonna raise five, now the number's up to 500 million. It was never anywhere close to that in estimates made by our own public service. Tory also points out that a number of questions and challenges have been raised about trying to bring a parking levy into effect. In a statement Monday, the mayor did say he would support another idea raised by the new TTC chair. I'm looking at imposing, uh, potentially imposing, we just want information at this point, uh, attacks on commuters. So Monday to Friday from whatever time, 7 a.m. to 5 p.m., where they would have to pay a, uh, a surcharge, a tax on paid parking. The idea to once again look at the parking levy is being brought forward as a 10 cent fare hike on the TTC is being considered along with a 9% reduction in services. Those who are here at City Hall today point to other major North American cities like New York, Los Angeles and Chicago who all have their own parking levies. Here in Canada, Montreal has one as well implemented years ago. It brings in something to the tune of $23 million annually. Mark McAllister, City News.